Hello everyone, it's Andrea and I'm here today with my colouring uh, supplies haul and some colouring books I've bought in the last month or so. Um, I think the last one I did was in June or May. Um, I did get some books in June because it was my birthday at the end. But I haven't been buying a huge amount so I thought I'd save them all up and do them in one go. So I'm just going to push the books out the way and start with the supplies. So I did get the 80 count set of the Touch 5 markers. I don't think I've shown them to you before. I love these markers. They are absolutely fantastic. So thank you, Anne from A Colourful Life, who is always recommending these. I love them. I just want to show you what I have been doing with them. I've actually been colouring in the book Serene by Nicholas Philbert with them. And this is what I have done so far and I really like it it's absolutely lovely so on the supplies front other than buying a few of the color soft pencils I only need six now to have the full 72 set the only thing I've really bought is two of the three Erodeton colored pencils I've got volumes one to three and four to six I hope to get seven to nine at the end of this month when I actually get paid. I like them, they are quite a hard pencil compared to Colours Often Prisma Colours, but uh, I really do like the colours. So, on to the books. So I've got Jade Summers Under the Sea colouring book. I hope to do a flip through of this shortly. Um, I got Magical Dawn by Hannah Calzen. I got Enchanted by Selena Fennec. My lovely partner Paul bought me Twilight Garden by Maria Troll for my birthday. I picked up a copy of Colour My Sketchbook by Bennett Klein, the first one. I um, haven't done anything from this yet. It is quite thin, so I would probably put it onto cardstock. I got Zemelia Snova which was got by one of the groups on Facebook. One of the girls in the group went to uh, abroad and actually brought the copy of this back. I got Island Paradise, again by Jade Summer. I actually wanted this one, but they didn't have it in stock. So I had, so I got the Under, Under the Sea one instead. Again, one of the lovely ladies in the colouring group gave me Escape to Christmas Past by Good Wives and Warriors. All I had to do was pay postage for this. So I'm really looking forward to Christmas and colouring in this one. I love these little books. I think the pictures are really good. And because Halloween is rapidly coming up, I got Lacey Sunshine's Halloween Colouring Book Volume 4, 30 Fun Witches, Pumpkins, Ghosts and Vampires to Colour. So I just thought this would be a really nice one. This is Heather Valentin's artwork. It's absolutely, they are so cute, these little ladies. So, and the drawings are just lovely. They're nice and simple. They're not too over the top. So you, you know, not too intricate. So you can have fun with them, which is nice. So I foresee lots of pencils and lots of glitter and stuff on these ones. So, um, yeah, so I really love the books I've got. I haven't been doing much colouring yet, I've got to be honest, I just haven't had time. Um, I'm hoping to do some colouring soon. For instance, I have started one in, let me just find it, Under the Sea by Jade Summer. If I can find it, it won't be a sec. Which is this one, and that's the tre treasure chest, and that's been with, done with colour soft pencils. But as you see, I still haven't finished it, and I've also got to finish the one from Serene um, with the the Touch Five markers. They so say that this stuff is really thick card, and they still go through. Let me just uh, see if I can show you. As you can see they they do still go through, but I do put a piece of card in there to stop it from going through onto the next page, but. That's that one. So I'm hoping to do the end of this one soon. I've not got much left. And then I might do another one. So I thought I'd just show you what I've been getting up to with my colouring lately. Um, at the end of the month, I plan on getting the next set of Tombows and of course, three more of the Colour Softs, which will then take me up to only having to get another three, which is fantastic. So there we go. So I have about 50, seven colouring books now I think not a huge amount compared to some people 
but still pretty good, especially as I haven't been colouring lately, I've got so much to do. So I'm going to actually go and do a bit of colouring now. If you want to see any of the colouring stuff that I've actually finished, leave me a comment down below and I will happily uh, show you some of the stuff I've done over the course of the year. Um, sometimes I can do three or four a month, sometimes I just do one every now and again. It depends on the mood I'm in because as mentioned, I've got so many hobbies, it is hard for me to uh, keep up with them all. So that's all for me for today. Um, if you've liked uh, the video, obviously give me a thumbs up, share it with your friends. Leave a comment if you want to see any more colouring stuff, if you want to colour in chat or if you want to see what I've actually done colouring wise and I'll pull them out and show you. And also don't forget to subscribe if you're not already a subscriber and I will hopefully see you soon. Bye now!